this is Jackie Tomlin and this is your general reading. We're looking at your week of February 10th, 2020. Gang, I am doing well, but the swelling and bruising is a lot more than I anticipated. So we're doing readings like this for a little bit. If you guys are seeking a psychic reading, contact me at JackieTomlin.com or find a link to these readings below this video. Um, as an Always, if you're enjoying these videos, please take the time to like, share, and subscribe. I greatly appreciate it. So, for your week of February 10th, look for quick new beginnings. And I really want to emphasize the word quick. Very high energy for Aries for the week of the 10th. Um, a lot of socializing going on as well. Maybe some expansion of that social circle. Um, there is a signing of a legal document or legal contract going your way or a large purchase new doors are opening up for you small wishes are being granted uh sudden changes going back with those quick new beginnings um quick changes around the home front as well and taking care of everyone and neglecting yourself could be a very possibility for you at the end of the week so be advised against that there is a lesson well learned and there is you letting go of something that no longer serves a purpose. So a lot of high energy going on. So let's take a look and we're looking at Aries. Aries, this is your week of February 10th, 2020. Okay, Aries, we're going to start with the Four of Cups, followed by the King of Cups and the High Priestess. So the Four of Cups is someone making you an offer, an unexpected offer of assistance. Love seeing this in any reading. The King of Cups shows stability, wise decisions, grounded, centered. Uh, taking authority and this is going to be important because I did make mention that I feel that you may let people take advantage of you towards the week's end. That high priestess coming in with those sudden changes, okay, uh, keeping your energy up, getting your way, uh, but sudden changes and also that lesson well learned, okay. So it's sudden changes but it's also a little bit of a delay in plans at the same time. Moving forward, you guys have the Six of Cups, you have the Three of Wands, and you have the Page of Swords. Now, the Six of Cups, what I'm seeing here, is reconnecting with someone from your past. Someone that you're very pleased to reconnect with. This is a good, positive thing. Three of Wands is that looking over your reflection of the past, okay? And like I said, for a lot of you, it's a lesson well learned. So look over the past. What worked well for you? What didn't? Take away what worked well. Leave the rest behind. Page of Swords coming in almost like the Fool, okay? Happiness, contentness, you get that small wish, new doors are opening, but don't get so caught up in happiness that you're not watching your footing or where you're going, okay? Moving forward, look at there, you guys got the Magician, you have the Death card, and we have the Ace of Cups. Wow, Aries, it's some powerful energy for you guys, starting with the Magician. This is the highest card in your deck. This is your yes answer. This is you get everything you want and desire is on the table before you. Okay. Then we have death card. And the death is the end of a negative cycle and those quick new beginnings that I'm talking about. The rebirth and a new beginning. Now, with it coming in as a death card, this is going to be emotional. The end of an emotional cycle, the start of a new emotional cycle. And don't forget it will be just that. It will be emotional. Also, that there is a rarity for me to pull both of these on one spread, let alone back to back. So that message is loud and clear to Aries. Sudden, quick, new beginnings. Okay? And then we also have a separate new beginning here coming in with the Ace of Cups, indicating a new beginning in love. Now that's going to be significant for my singles as well as my couples out there. So just really strong, powerful week. Um, Energy-wise, what I'm looking at here is that of the Taurus. And that of a Cancer, I want to throw that out there as well. But what your guys are looking at is that High Priestess. Remember, this is um, getting what you want, but also a delay in plans. We do have this, yes, you definitely get what you want. 
every, this kind of overrides your entire reading. You get everything you want, desire, and of course, the emotional new beginning. So, Aries, thank you guys for watching. Please take the time to like, share, and subscribe. Don't forget to check out your daily videos as well as your weekend. And I'll see you soon. Bye.